The Joe Brothers Art Center of Kansas City will repurpose the historic Crispus Attics Elementary School building. The lead contractor on the project tells me this is likely the original cornerstone built in 1905. Breaking ground on the 70,000 square foot Joby Art Center. We start from Today. These are renderings from BNIM of what they plan to do with the former school. The building is 117 years old and named after a black man who died in the Boston Massacre of 1770 between colonists and British soldiers. Over the last two decades, the building has sat abandoned, but that changes today. We get to celebrate an amazing, an amazing transformation in the core of our community. The Joe brothers are some of the most creative, innovative people in the world. City officials recently gave the Joe brothers out of Chicago $2 million in grant money to preserve the structure. The brothers are also spending $30 million in private funds to turn it into an art center. With uh, Kansas City, Joe B. Azenda, that means it's lifetime commitment for Joe brother. I can say I'm very excited in this moment. It really makes me feel like it, this will be our home. There will be a sculpture garden, gallery spaces, 45 studios, and an immersive digital experience. The Art Center will also be home to spaces for weddings and community events. We have no doubt that this project will help us further our mission and directly benefit artists and the community as a whole. With future plans to bring more restaurants, stores, and even a brewery to 18th and Vine, Congressman Emanuel Cleaver sees a destination for locals and tourists. This is as excited as I've been since we started trying to rebuild this, this whole area. The project is expected to wrap up next August with the ribbon cutting and open art center to follow. Regan Porter, Fox 4, working for you.